1940s Hot Point Electric Range. This is a 40 inch model. And I'm doing all the cooking for the week now. There's not too much time to cook during the week, so I like to do it all on the weekend. I'm boiling the chicken for chicken soup in the uh, institutional stock pot. And I've got the ham for the macaroni salad here. I've got various other things baking in the two ovens. I can roast brisket at 250 degrees in one oven and bake other dishes in the uh, other oven at a different temperature. It's really convenient. Here's the push button control panels. And these controls could probably use a little bit of polishing. And they're not in too bad a shape. Got the right front boiling for macaroni. There's the clock. Clock works properly. And I got the chicken boiling on the left rear. There's the oven timer. The oven timer does work. And then this lamp, this lamp, the lettering came off. It did say automatic. And then there's another lamp back behind the pot which said hot point. And the left lamp lights up when the left oven is on. And the uh, right one lights up when the right oven heating element is on. Here are the oven controls. This one, the lamp doesn't work, but the oven does work. This one, the lamp is functional. And they must have blown the internal fuse in there. I need to find where the fuse is because this little, uh, this outlet doesn't work. But as far as all the cooking and baking functions, they all do work. There was bad wiring at the ballast, so I had to disconnect the fluorescent lamp circuit. I'll, I'll convert to an electronic ballast sometime. I just need to rewire that circuit. But the, most of the wiring in here had been redone at some point. I checked out all the wiring, except for the fluorescent lamp circuit. It was all good uh, and had been well maintained over the years. I think this is probably from the late 1940s. Here's the 1950s General Electric refrigerator and freezer. And somebody painted this this uh, chocolate color, or the, this kind of dark brown color. It was originally white. They did a real good paint job on it, real professional job. But when you open it up, you can see inside that it was originally white. And of course, this is probably not a color the uh, refrigerator would have come in. in say 1952 and I've got my Zenith Motel TV up here just need to clean a few things off there all the best music on Frank and Friends at Cannibal AM